How y'all doing? It's Trucker Taylor here again. <clears throat> it's gonna be a video about um, truck parking, you know, for, so you could do your 10 hour reset at the end of the day. You know what I mean? Um, you don't necessarily have to park at a truck stop like literally every night. You know, I mean, in a perfect world, you wanna park at a truck stop so you can, you know, take a shower or get some food, you know, uh, wash some clothes, whatever you wanna do. But I mean, you don't necessarily have to park at a truck stop. I mean, and then, and then you don't have to park actually at a, like in a trucking spot, like a parking spot. You can park like at the truck stop. I mean, I, I, I park like some places. Um, like they basically, well, all truck stops mostly, but they got mechanic shops that close at like 9 p.m. You know, around that time, around 8, 9 p.m. Sometimes you can back your truck up, like basically to one of the, the bay doors, you know, because they close and, and they and, and they basically going to open up probably like around seven seven a.m. So you can park your truck there for the night. That's what I do most of the time. Like, you know, I, I mean, well, not all the time, but I do it. I do it every now and then. But sometimes I just back up to one of the bay doors because they close anyway so they don't really care you know you can just back up to the bay door and then leave in the morning you know first thing in the morning i usually leave around six so that way i don't you know i'll be in their way at all you know they basically be gone the whole time there anyway so <clears throat> especially like, like you know you know if i park at loves or something like that that's that's mostly what i do you know but if you can't find a, a parking space you know you can still park somewhere in the truck stop you know uh, I, I, I park I parked right next to the um, to the, the scale one time. You know, I mean, I done that. So as, long, as long as you're not blocking no one from like exiting, like like you know, entering, exiting the truck stop. If, if you're not in the way, it don't hurt nothing. You know, and, and, and most most truck stops really don't care. So, so as long as you're not in the way of like people getting on the scale or something like that. Because uh, if you start blocking people from going on the scale or you. You, you sort of block a lane from people getting to the back then then that's when they're gonna call someone they're gonna basically go to the front desk and go, you know and they basically gonna tell you to move you know you got to move somewhere you can't just block a whole like a whole row or or, or the scale you know what I'm saying so or you can park most times a gas station close or whatever I mean I, I, I park at gas stations too like right across the street from the truck stop I've done that too, you know. I mean, so as long as you talk to the person in there, be like, "Hey, is it cool?" You know, you know, if they got like an open spot in the back, and you could whip your truck back there, you know, park it for the night. Hey, it is what it is, you know. I, I mean, I, I usually park at like Walmart. I, I can park at Walmart um, parking lots, like big open areas. I mean, I mean, I mean, most times the big open area, people really don't care, you know. You can just as long as you're not blocking nothing. And so, so as long as people can get through. You know, and still have access to the store or whatever, you're good. You know, I I, I even parked at um, just like a band. It was it was like a what was it? I think I, I think it was like a parking lot, but but it was like an abandoned school or some some type of big building. And I parked my truck right there for the night. Like I don't care, you know, or just park, park at um, rest stops. But I I usually want to park somewhere where it's well lit. You know, that I feel safe. You know. I don't know. I, I, my, my safety is everything. So, and I want some way I can get some food in the morning. Like I wake up hungry as fuck, so I want some breakfast or something. You know what I mean? I gotta put something in my belly. You know what I mean? Psh, nigga, nigga, nigga. <laughs> but I'm telling you, man. I mean, don't don't be don't be stressing yourself out. Like you don't necessarily have to park in a parking space at a truck stop every time. Because I I, I see people that like they basically pull into the truck stop. And then and then they, and then they can't find a parking space, so they just leave. And then and, and, they, and then they go to another truck stop. Like why? You just find a place, like some anywhere. Like 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 it's, it's people that park. That's like um I I I've seen people park on the side of the road a little bit. But so as long as you're not blocking nothing, I'm telling you like if you're not blocking nothing, you're good. You're golden. You know from I mean for the most part these truck stops are relaxed. Like pilot, cool as fuck. I mean, I mean, it was, it was only one time that I, I really had to move. Like it was, I went to a Love's truck stop, 
and this dude was just being an asshole, like, at, at, the, at the desk, like, he just, I don't know, he just being a dick, like, we, we wasn't blocking nothing, like, it was like three trucks, wasn't blocking nothing, it was like away from the fuel aisle, all that, well, away from everybody, good to go, but he came out there and was like, hey man, you can't park the truck here, man, you know, you know, if you can't find a spot, you gotta leave, I'm like, really, like, you, like, it's bothering you that much, like, that much, that you had to come out and say something. Like, it's bothering him that much. Like, he, he, he just, he just was like the, uh, I guess he was like, uh, he, he felt so he had power and shit, so he was a power junkie, so he, he felt empowered to come out there and tell us to move. Like, he just felt good inside. He was just like, I, damn, I, I, I got enough power to, to just tell people to move, and they actually move. Like, I like this. Like, that's, that's all he is. Fucking asshole, man. I'm telling you, bro. You can park at the mechanic shop. Just back up to the bay door. But 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 it has to be one that closes at like eight or nine o'clock. You know, if they close, you can back up to that bay door and just sit there for the night and then leave early first thing tomorrow morning. You know, people do that all the time. You know, and, and apparently a lot of people don't know that. You know, they they, they think it's a crime or whatever. But I don't know. But um, I'm telling you, what well, was the place you can park? I mean, just just find just find an open lot anything walmart if you see a walmart man you can park in the parking lot you know as long as you park all the way in the back all the way in the back but i mean of course the small like the neighborhood walmarts i wouldn't park there i don't know they, they might say something because it's, it's kind of tight and limited on parking already so you and then you probably can't fit your truck in there but but but, but you can't park at the super center you know what i mean the, the big the big time walmarts the big open parking lots you know, or, or, or just find like a gas station that has like a big open lot in the back. You know, you can park in the back, you know, for the night. But but you can't take a shower. That's the only bad thing, you know. But, I mean, hey. I mean, I, I went a few days without taking a shower. It's not a big deal. But, um, this, this, this is a video about parking just then. And then I'm, I'm making another video about um, a video for the new guys, you know, that, that's coming into truck. I'm gonna make a video about that too, right after this one. Well, I mean, I'm I'm, I'm just here to help y'all out, man. You know, um, I, I don't I don't want y'all getting blindsided, you know, and being worried. You know, this is this is not a bad bad field. You know, you, you just gotta make the best of it. You gotta improvise a little bit. But um, I want y'all to take it easy. And um, God bless y'all. And please like and subscribe to this video. I'm about to make another video right after this one. I'm in Alabama right now. Yeah, so I can, I can be home for the weekend. I'm like close to Mississippi, so. Got into the crib, bro. You know what I mean? It's been a long five days. Well, four days. Four days, technically. Because like, I started on Monday. Yeah. It's been a long five days. I'm about to, I gotta go home and see my wife, bro. I'm telling you, dog. I'm telling you. Shit. I gotta clean my truck, bro. It's a little dirty, dog. I'm hungry. Like truck stop a little bit, man. Nigga. 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 <laughs> Nigga hungry. Yeah, boy. But y'all take it easy. And God bless y'all. Another video's coming right after this one. Peace.